Hello everybody, welcome back to another video here today on the channel, and today we're going to be doing something a little bit different, and this is yet another haul video. Now, if you don't know or have not seen my community post, um, or even my Instagram post for this matter, um, I found a job at Toys R Us. And during my four shifts that I've done so far, I finally was able, at the end of my shift, to buy some stuff. So... I bought some really unique stuff that I didn't even think was in Canada. I thought it was only available in the States. And um, you, you'll you get to know as this video goes along that I'm a big fan of these certain stuff. So here's the bag right here in question. And now let's get into this die, this, not die cast, but this haul. Um, I guess we'll start off the first, the first item. First up. We got Witch Maggie from The Simpsons. Um, this is the Trails of Horror right here. Looks really nice. Very cool stuff. I didn't even think I was ever going to get this Funko Pop, to be quite honest. There's the back of the box. There's Snail Lisa, Hugo Bart, Homer Zilla, and Skeleton Marge. They sh I really want Funko to make more of these. Very cool stuff. I love how, how like you know, uh, uh, you know um how how Maggie has you know the pacifier in her mouth still. That's pretty cute. There's also the wand, the stick. Like Funko does a really good job in making these Funko Pops. So yeah, this first out of five items down. Uh, as I'm gonna put it right here. Got a lot of water bottles around. Next up, um, we got um, another Funko Pop. Uh, Black Adam right here. Technically, this is a Dwayne Johnson Funko Pop, but just as, you know, a, um, a as Black Adam, the DC Comics. I remember I saw this movie. I liked it a lot. Very glad to have this in my collection. Funko Pops. So yeah, I love the detail right here on, on pretty much Black Adam. Like from what I've heard, this is like a the downgrade, not downgrade, but the other version of Shazam. So yeah, really badass looking Funko Pop. Not going to spend too much time on it. Let's go to the next one. Here's a Hot Wheels die cast. It's a, um, a Lotus um, Amira. Never heard of this car, but... It looks brand new. Very exotic looking car. I love I love the detail on this thing. And people like to call these toy cars. I mean they are, but like they're do, does this look like a toy car or a collectible for collectors to buy? Honest question. Like you got the box, you got the render of the car. Back end of the box. Very neat looking stuff and a very neat looking car. Um I love the paint scheme. Not paint scheme. I love the design of the car. Like the dark red. You got the engine at the back end. You got the interior. Like that's something you won't see on some of the NASCAR Fenix die casts. So yeah. That's the third out of the, the five items. Here's, here's Hot Wheel right here. Another one. The last one. This is an Audi R5 e-tron GT. I love the color on this thing, and it looks like it has a European license plate. That's pretty cool. And tail plates as well. Dark gray, I like gray. I remember I saw these commercials, I believe, on TV back in 2020. I'm not 100 percent sure. This box is kind of a little bit bended, a little bit bend. It looks a little bit bend. It looks bended a little bit, but oh well. There's that kind of the box. Um. As we just looked at it, just you got also the render of the car. Just a really nice looking car. Apparently, I think it's a electric car, but either way, it still looks really nice. And now, the moment y'all been waiting for, the one I've been really excited to get the most I saved for the last, it's on a F1 die cast. How about this? I never thought they'd actually sell, sell these in Canada. I thought these were only available in the States, but Baringo here are Barago, I'm still gonna call them Baringo. Um, they um, 
they actually sell these because they sell the normal cars. And I just, I just gotta say thank you, Beringo, for blessing me with an indie car, not indie car, I meant F1 diecast. And as you can see, this is a um, a George Russell. Back in the box, one. This is a 143 scale diecast. Um, says 2011, right there. I don't know. Um, I don't know if it's from 2011 or recent. Probably recent. Um, you got Lewis Hamilton right there. Looks really nice. My first F1 diecast. How about this? Awesome looking stuff. The underside of the box. So yeah, I love the detail on it. It looks metal chassis, and I know it has 3 Plus on it, but still, it looks more like a collectible than a toy. Honestly, it does. Very cool stuff. In fact, I like how there's a track to go along with it. That's pretty cool. So there's your five items. To recap, there's Witch Maggie from The Simpsons, Black Adam, the F1 diecast with Lewis Hamilton and George Russell, the Audi... Um, our 5 e-tron gt and the lotus emira so yeah thank you all so much for watching if you did enjoy this video make sure to give it a like comment subscribe turn on the notification bell comment down below what you think about these these items that i purchased do you have any of them yourselves i'll see you in the next video peace out